Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today it is a very cool Stratter Day. Woo! Um, yes, and we're also going to do Spec Check with Brandon Soriano. Hey. Hello! Yes, and up? we have a treat today, I believe. Oh my. Um, oh yeah. One of the coolest Strats I've played, um, and yeah, so... That's yeah, I would say one of the coolest strats on the planet. Yeah, <laughs> Probably. it really is. Honestly, it's pretty nuts, man. So look at that case, that brown Tolex. Uh, from 1960. 6-0, 1960. This is a Fender Strat. Whoa. In Olympic white, a little bit of buttering going on. Look at that, mm -hmm. man. I love it. Kind. That is gorgeous. And uh, you heard me right, 1960 is the year, despite how clean this thing is. And uh, I'm just going to get this out of the way right now. It's all original. Wow, it's yeah. all original, which is nuts. We got this from a friend of Norm's, a friend of his for many years, who uh, brought it in along with another thing that you're probably going to see on the show soon, and he took very good care of his guitars. When he came in, he actually had the case saran wrapped, <laughs> um, and I had to unwrap it. <laughs> so, yeah, but what was inside was well worth it. Uh, 1960, we've talked about this pretty recently on the show, actually, um, but this would be a slab rosewood board, and if you're not familiar with the slab boards you can always tell the slab board by uh, the curvature up top here above the nut and by the fact that the rosewood kind of digs into the truss rod adjustment screw down there um, a slab board is going to be a much thicker cut of rosewood as compared to the veneer board which came shortly after this so when you first start seeing rosewood boards on fenders in like 1959 um, this is how they came uh, through the early 60s and then starting more early to mid 60s they transitioned over to the veneer board. This is an early slab board example. The dots are made out of clay. These are not pearl or purloid. They're clay dots. So they're a little more satin, a uh, darker color. It's a bit more subdued looking. Um, also important about this guitar is that you're going to have a three-way switch instead of a five-way switch. So on a modern Strat, as we know them today, you would get the neck pickup and then there would be a middle position here that would be these two pickups shared before you go to the middle and then another position for these two pickups together before going to the bridge. You can still do that on this guitar, but you kind of have to balance it like that. And then if you hit it the wrong way, it's, it's really easy to move. So, I mean, for a live setting, you realistically only have the three positions. But if you're in the studio or if you're playing at home or whatever, um, then you can actually still get those mixed positions in there. We opened this one up and it's all original. Yep. All five springs are still in the back, which is super cool. We've got our offset screws on the back plate, so you know it's legit. Uh, this is one of the rare models that I've seen where the serial number is actually on the bottom of the neck plate instead of the top. Yeah, I noticed that right away. Yeah, just kind of a funny little quirk of this guitar, the fact that they did that. Got a little nice bird's eye there. Really just a crazy example, super fast neck. Yeah, the um, neck's amazing. Killer tone, dude. I mean, this thing just plays great. It sounds great. We do have the original ashtray bridge cover and the bar as well in here. So all original. Original case, original bar, cover, the guitar, the electronics are original frets are original this thing is straight it is clean and mike is gonna give it a go let's do it let's thank you Brandon. It sounds like thanks mike Woo. thank you thank you jen you're welcome you're welcome <laughs> we're off front with the really cool 1960 fender stratocaster in white really amazing guitar one of the best i've played uh we're going through a 1967 fender deluxe reverb starting off on that neck pickup let's see what we get
Cool, let's go to middle pickup, see what we get. Turn on some distortion. Stratocaster in white, absolutely killing one of the best strats I've played. Um, you can check them all out at normandrayguitars.com and also on Instagram and Facebook. I'm your host, Michael Emma. See you soon. Bye. Cool. Cool. It's cool. Sweet.